Alright, so you said protagonist wins these mostly. I mean, not surprised. Uh, yeah, GT, I know he's taking a set of pretty big spots, so I think it's 2 0. But I, but I think Protex taking a bunch. He got a little bit of a fox, uh, fox run up earlier, but he kind of struggled. Way different style of fox. Yeah. It, perhaps a little knowledge of the player can make a big difference in this matchup. Uh, because all you have to do is catch one bad habit, and you're in. One fox every time. Yeah. Great. Oh, yeah. that's that's oh the fort smash. That's a load of holding for you. Or Loyal Fortune's way better. Yeah. I mean, generally. And, and that person makes someone low like that? Yeah, you want to Loyal Fortune. Hey, this is the up row. tag makes it back. And he's the ball. 69 field tag. Jeez, he had a couple of things earlier, too. Uh, issue mastering that. Nice back here by GT. Nice back here. Like, well, so, like, Fox can go straight up and he can miss that, so... It's kind of a hard read. And he can go straight a lot of times, like... Legend. He'll get to the ledge where like it's too fast for you to react. So it's it's kind of like a, you have to do a gamble there and you take a gamble about it. Ooh, that was what saves. Protag taking a big risk so going GT for this now. The problem with uh, when he gets a hit on the box, he doesn't land and grab right away. He like he's really slow after like Z canceling to grab. And we saw it there he got that forward air and like he get a grab and uh, Protag was like shot or jab or something. Right. Um, and it was happened to you a couple times too. Are you talking about like the slow to initial dash? No, like where like your Pika, you forward your Fox, and he's right in front of you, you've got to get a grab right away. Like, right, right. Uh, GT like gets the hit, and he doesn't like react right away to recognize that he's getting the hit, and go into the grab. He like hesitates to like process the fact that he got a hit, and then he goes to the grab, but that time, that time he, jab he did it really quick that time. Um, but I think... Uh, that was off the up tilt though. It's usually when he's coming down with yeah. aerial. He, he's not quick with aerial to grab. I um, think... That's a, a new player thing. Like you have to shake off that hesitation. Yeah. It's not just. I, I also think. I think it's more of a, a not being a high skill player because uh, against a lower level fox, their pro their reaction time after getting hit isn't as fast to get out of the punish, right? So like Protag is going to be pretty quick. On the, like the frame window that Protag is going to take advantage of is going to be near frame perfect for his escape. Right. While like a player like you know Cactus or something, right, who plays fox, they're probably they're, they're not going to be as close to frame perfect as another escape. So you have a, a larger window to you know react and take your time with that. Right. It's one thing that makes the LD so hard to punish, even after hit, is because he doesn't give you any window uh, right. outside of the, the, the game's maximum or minimum window that it gives you uh, to punish. Wow, Pro Tag, we're it back. So, all tied up. Oh, GT uh, managed to build himself a pretty good lead. Pro Tag is facing the wrong way. I put that up here, I think he was facing the wrong way. There, and GT, GT, oh, he got the back there, anyways, but. I, a very simple protagonist says, I would have liked to see GT follow him out with the Nair. Like, instead of Nair and then land on stage, he could have Nared and gone off the stage with Protag and then had the back air earlier. Oh uh, yeah, I think uh, he played it well though. It can be tricky or he's riding a fox that's like taken to go far away. Right. Because sometimes like you'll put an aerial to hit him coming in and then he'll pull back and then you're not in a position to follow up and get and cover the next option. And then fox is the only thing that's safe. I guess. I mean you can snap the ledge and that gives you a good amount of options too, whether it's to aerial from the ledge or to get up up tilt from the ledge. Like But I mean what he did worked and that's Oh, Protag oh. misses the up smash. He, he, he gets like he gets misses the strong hit of the up smash. He gets the weak hit. He missed a couple earlier too. So on there, so after she so was jabbing the shield, I think and as Fox, instead of just pushing them off and trying to punish the push off, just grab them, throw them off, you know? Right. So right. Maybe you get a laser kill. Um, maybe you get him on the edge guard. <laughs> oh, this could be it. GT gets the up tilt. And there. There. That was good. Oh! He doesn't finish the job? And I I feel like I don't know. I don't know if Protag was still in hit stun there, but it felt like he could have upbeat earlier and made it. <laughs> Protag, the the peak assault lately with Protag has been like off the charts. It was like something flipped the switch in him lately to where he really hates Pikachu. <laughs> he's always had a really hated Pikachu. I know, but he's it's, he's got a little more vocal about have, it. We just need to have a major every time we play, so we always play the best. <laughs> If you, Pro tag like, if you like, Loki makes bragging as well at every single major with like a solid quality win. Uh, if, then in weekly you can lose to GT. Pro tag if you win this you it's a notable win you get on the rankings. 
Uh, yeah, GTB cheers. GTB yeah, GTB, GTB cheers. So now if Protag beats GT, then he makes it on the ranking. Oh, yeah. No room for an up smash there. Dash attack was pretty good. Low angled F tilt for the set knockback. I think GT landed and just didn't recognize that. Team. Probably yeah, not. Sure. Probably in panic yeah, mode. Panic mode. <laughs> Gra the grabs are okay. Z cancel there pretty much. Pretty protect it, so you can touch shield. Caught and shield there. Dash attack. 69 for GT right now. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so he pushed him off stage. He can read his recovery. GT makes back on the stage. But Protag catches him with that back air. All tied up. Oh, he runs through him. Very dangerous. He is playing a very dangerous game. Oh, <laughs> he does a snipe him. Oh, two standing lasers. Yeah, I mean, Pico can follow you down there, though. I mean, he was already committed with that back here. That high. Okay, jab. Oh, he doesn't get there. We go. Jab. All right. I, I, we missed that, and he, he followed up really well by getting on the position to punish GT's tech. Yeah, the laser wasn't as fire hits there. If he got that, the standing laser. The combo into the standing laser. That's where it's at. Protag oh, putting himself a little way too close to the Oh, I like how Protag came out and did that, that, that like 40 like, like floated it over here. <laughs> according to Bark, or air. according to Bark, Fox invalidates the entire cast after he lost it. Uh, <laughs> Fox invalid, he invalidates the entire cast except for Pikachu. And that's not what you said after you lost the Anakin's. Well, yeah. <laughs> And then I beat him with Shock the next day. He was playing pretty well that day, but I don't know what happened in Grants. The protag, angry protagonist. I, I have this weird feeling that angry protagonist is just gonna run the whole thing back. He's just gonna pull it out of his ass. Oh no, you didn't want to go standing laser again? <laughs> Jab, up smash. Wow, and he took a pretty clean stock there. Uh, very clean. He didn't take any damage. That was he took the last stock and then did zero to death basically. Not like yeah. not a clean zero to death. Melee. Like melee zero to death. Though. Smash four zero. To death. Well, Smash 4 Zero to Death could be like three hits if you're the yeah. Is it really? No, <laughs> but I mean, like, you can kill it like 30%. It's nuts. Nice. He's got double rage mechanics. It's like, ridiculous. Oh, four air into up smash. Not, not high enough. I wonder if hits the root root. No, wow, Protect. Wow. Like you said, uh, Avery Protect is going to go on a rampage. He just did three straight socks there. Yeah. I mean, GT's getting good, but when you... He's like, now he's like the Antag. <laughs> the Antagonist. <laughs> Angry Protag is the Antag. Is it really 83%? Is that after the hit or before? Uh, before. I think, uh, There's no jab up smash hit. Uh, set, okay, I was gonna say. See, I thought it was like mid 70s, but it's saying it's 67. But yeah, uh, if you're well, like, a there, you have. When, when you're a more experienced player, you can do some crazy things with blocks. Yeah, like like had GT in a position where he could smash, missed it. Did you get the grab him off stage and now he's gonna quickly turn that stuff around? Yeah. Oh, that oh wow! Unedge guardable. <laughs> I don't like how he did that again, where he jumped up. Like, yeah. GT's reading that almost every time. He's just gonna up tilt you. 
You just um, need to take, um, you just need to take stage control, basically. Like, stop trying to turn, like, uh, a small yeah, mistake from mistake. your opponent. Wait. Oh! He ledge just cancel. got edge cancel! Hey, ledge cancel, this game didn't get it! Oh, wow. So he baited out that grab from GT and ran in with one of his own. GT's pretty good at uh, hitting the ledge. He's had a couple SDs today, but overall he's got some pretty good angles. And pro tag ties it up. Probably should have had a, a decent lead, but you know, a couple mistakes will put you in this position. Oh, yeah, after the shine there, he realized that Pico was right inside of him. He had no answer besides giving himself a little space. That back there, very risky. GT does not have an answer for all this oh, pressure. Yeah, I know. Protect. The pressure for the experiment is great. So he's got him off stage, but that down tilt there is not going to do it. Oh, wow. He waited out that up tilt that time and came in with an aerial. Oh, wow. He missed the up smash. Yeah, he got the jab, just didn't dash it. And GT. Yeah, oh, Force Match is so bad. bad. Force Match is like one of the worst ones in the game. Like, yeah. when is Pika's person ever good? Unless it's like, literally, there's nice. nothing else you can do other than miss the ledge anyway, and then all you're doing is covering a spot of the ledge that they're not going to grab. But, like, Pika's forward smash is almost oh, useless. Oh, Protag missed the up smash again. <laughs> Protag has had several opportunities to build himself a decent lead. He keeps hitting these weak hits. He's got a strong hit on Pika. Well, I mean, the weak hits are fine, but when you got him on stage, no, weak, up weak hits are just letting Pika get back to the stage. See? It's bad. And, yeah, he pays for it. He had an up smash opportunity and just threw it away. <laughs> oh, again. Uh, you messed up a lot, Protag. <laughs> jab, up smash. Whoa, jab. weak up smash? Come on, game. Protag, get a break. I think there he should have opted for no, no, Once you get on those jabs and show that percentage, oh. you just got to grab. Protag cannot kill this Pikachu. I don't, I don't like how he's like, he's like jabbing on shield. At 150, just go for the grab. Jab, yeah. jab shield. Don't keep jabbing shield. Grab him. Yeah, it, like after that jab where he got the weak up smash, he could have, uh, I think, done a nair instead. Probably would have killed, him. or at least been better than going for the up smash. Crazy eye. Yeah. Oh, he gets out of the jab grab. Jab grab's bad. Let's go, Baltimore. Oh, uh, GT, good spacing on that. The oh, shine! did he get it? Oh, he got the album. We go smash it. What is he doing? <laughs> This, that could have turned the tide of the entire set. Yeah. Protag took sca stage control and survived. Well, oh, not that order. That's Merit shield by GT. That's 69%. Back air does not reach. I'm not sure if GT uh, stick jumped that one, but he couldn't make it. It's four tilt, but he gets his jump. Snaps onto the ledge. Oh, Protag just barely misses that grab. Pog champ. Oh, man. He gets back the throw, back grab. throw. Go for back throw. More damage, more knockback. You put him in a, a position where it's hard to recover. See? There you go. That's you what got, you gotta do. You got so that's what I was saying before. Yeah. When you get the jab on shield at that percentage, just go for a grab. You either kill him with and get him off stage, or you get him in a very hard recovery position, which you can usually reliably get the edge guard. Protag is having a hard time catching on to some of GT's habits. GT goes for the ledge almost every single time, but Protag has opted to stand back and let him grab the ledge. We got a two-stock um, game here. Smash four. Oh no! He jumped into that back there. See if he can make it back. Good Great down tilt. tilt. The Nair, and that's going to put up a stock. Full stock. Oh, it still says winner so much. Uh, whatever. Um, we, need, we need that stream manager sync up. Pro tag to see if he can make it back. That up air is not going to do it. Wait, he clanked. He clanked. You see he clanked. He's got him with that clank of what he goes up tilt. It went right through it. Oh, he caught him out of that shield, but not well, enough knockback. If you get the weak over, you could have all smash over nice. Uh oh. That's bad. roll away, but that's, that's even worse. Oh, he got the jab. Yeah, that, GT, that four is, bad, is very um, quick to run in for that grab. GT di down, which is really, really good. He grabs protagonist's jab, and that'll do it. And GT pulls it out two to one. What um, what GT did really well there at the end was he di down to stay close to the ground, so Protag couldn't get enough smash even if he got him off stage.